Welcome to the Criticuculus. I'm the Monk, and today we're in Wasteland 3, and we are looking at the exoskeleton suit. Now, this exoskeleton suit is a late game item. In fact, you get a chest piece for this in one of the very last rooms, actually, in the game. Um, but I figured out a way, or I found a way, of actually getting a complete set mid-game. Maybe late mid-game. You have to basically clear uh, Aspen in order to get a piece or a component to get the the chest piece early anyway so the first piece the helmet the earliest part of the game you can get this in um, is actually the abandoned oil well now this is a really strange area there's absolutely nothing else in this area apart from these juvies you talk to one of them and after that, he doesn't really say anything at all. In fact, none of them say anything. They all just stare at you, following you around, no matter where you go. Um, the only thing you can do, really, is attack them. If you do attack them, you'll get knocked out. No damage will happen to your party. They'll all disappear. The oil well will be gone. And in the rubble, you will find the helmet for the exoskeleton suit. Now the exoskeleton suit is incredibly powerful. You get a 15% melee buff uh, on each piece you get. This is the first one that you can obtain. Uh, the easiest one to obtain, really. You just drive around. Uh, this area is located just above, just north of the massacre site. I've done videos on, on the massacre site before, so you shouldn't really have too much trouble finding the massacre site. Uh, check out one of those other videos and you will find this so you just simply loot in this junk pile uh, and you'll get amongst some other things the exoskeleton helmet uh, it requires uh, seven strength to wear it and three in weird science as well um, it on its own is actually a huge buff and something to actually look into getting it's pretty good. You get some other things too, along with another one of those creepy dolls. The exoskeleton legs can be found in the paint mines. This is a sub-quest that you can unlock um, fairly early on into the game. You can get, like I said, you can get the legs if you loot another junk pile. Um, I'll show you on the map exactly where it's coming from. Um, it's pretty easy to get. It's a pretty easy area as well, a pretty easy side mission. And so the first part, you have to get two dolls. The first doll and the second doll are both in toasters. So you have to repair these toasters in order to get it. Um, so you get the poke action doll, doll sorry, uh, in Aspen. It's the very last room in Aspen, uh, just after you either defeat Victory or you get him uh, in your party. Depends on what you do really um, but that's where you can get him as you can see it's the very last room um, so you have to do everything else first there's no way of really bypassing that unfortunately uh, the last doll that you need to get is in another toaster now this is actually in victory room you can get this doll pretty early in you just have to hack a computer and have some good nerd stuff or, of course, you can bring Victory with you, and then you'll have access to this room as well. Um, so, like I said, you can actually get this doll relatively early. You just need to go to the back. You'll find the toaster, need to repair it, and you'll have the last doll. With these two dolls, you then need to go to the Patriarch, Patriarch um, present him the dolls, and he give you the chest piece as a reward. These toasters are pretty good. You normally get some half decent stuff anyway. So considering uh, you get a chest piece for the exoskeleton suit tied into these toaster repairs, it's not actually a bad idea to get it done. And there we go. As you see, we've got the peak doll. Like I said, you just give them both to the patriarch. Apparently, they were both his growing up anyway. So he thinks it's quite novel and gives you a reward for this. Um, you do sometimes, like I couldn't get this to actually trigger uh, originally to actually give him the stuff. You need to get through a few dialogue options. So, for instance, I don't really want to spoil the story, but if you if you just go through all the dialogue options after getting these dolls, 
it will trigger and he will give you the reward for it. Like I said, the reward is actually the exoskeleton chess piece. Um, and again, that gives you the standard extra 15% melee buff. Um, and you need the three weird science and the seven in strength in all of these pieces in order to actually equip them. Or you'll get a debuff. You don't really want the debuff. Um, the weird science isn't too much of a problem. It's only three points. So it's definitely worth doing. Like I said, there it is, the exoskeleton chest armor. And there we go. We have just got one of the most powerful suits of armor in the game. Um, pretty early on in and it's definitely worth doing if you've got a melee character whether it's blunt uh, bladed or brawling it's worth putting it on because it's a massive 45 percent damage bonus uh, it looks absolutely awesome as well like i said you just need the three weird science and the seven strength and then you're all cushy and ready to go well that's it I've been the monk and we've been a critically clueless. I really hope you're enjoying these wasteland videos. I'm trying to bring you as many decent ones uh, as I can. Like I said, I've popped this on my Iron Man build. I've actually got a build for my brawler. It works incredibly well. Uh, if you've been enjoying these videos, maybe think about subscribing if you haven't already. Don't forget to like the video and drop your thoughts as well because we always like to hear you guys. We're getting a lot of comments at the moment and uh, it's good to hear um, what you guys are up to in the wasteland. So... Have a good day, hope you enjoyed the video, and I will leave you on a little bit more footage of me actually using this exoskeleton suit and uh, Iron Fist as well, and just how good this brawler build actually is right now. Again, hope you had a good day guys, and I'll catch you again soon.